heart, help everyone stay safe as we continue to fight the spread. And we can protect those most vulnerable around us. With easy access to vaccination locations and the growing ability for more people to be protected, it's our best shot to keep moving forward. It's our best shot for a strong, healthy community. For more information, visit miamidade.gov slash vaccine. Good morning. It's Tuesday and it's 11 a.m., which means it's time for the FIU Music Hour on WDNA 88.9 FM, where we present live weekly performances in the WDNA Jazz Gallery and feature students, faculty, and alumni from Florida International University's Herbert and Nicole Wertheim School of Music and Performing Arts. I'm your host today and FIU faculty, Dr. Russ Spiegel, and along with our executive producer, Dr. Karen Velaz, we'd like to welcome you to our show. Whether you're listening to us at home, in your car, or live on WDNA.org slash FIU, we are delighted to have you with us. And today, we are pleased to feature the FIU Jazz Faculty Band with professors and jazz coordinator Jamie Owsley. On bass, Mike Eckroth on piano and Ludwig Afonso on drums. And we are going to hear All or Nothing at All and Chan's song. Thank you. 
That's some fine swinging music by FIU jazz faculty, and I am here speaking with the coordinator of the jazz uh, department at FIU, Jamie Osley, Professor Jamie Osley. How are you doing, sir? Hello, Dr. <laughs> Good. Russ Spiegel. Very well, thank you very much. <laughs> Fantastic. Um, can you tell us a little about, uh, about the musicians we're listening to today? Well, sure. Um, these are um, two relatively new faculty. They've, this is their second year on our faculty. On piano, we have uh, Dr. Michael Eckroth, who, uh, you know, we, we're very happy to have. He's just been a great infusion to our program, and it's very exciting, and uh, our piano program is flourishing, and I can see the, the, the seeds that have been planted are starting to grow, so it's really nice. And on drums, we have somebody I've known for a very long time, uh, Professor Ludwig Afonso. Um, we were students together and were uh, fussed at by many of the same teachers as we were growing up. And uh, it's so great to have him on the faculty. We, I mean, um, bass and drums is a very special relationship. And so, uh, that's a, you know, we get along really well. I'll just put it that way. At least from my side. I don't know about what he would say, but, <laughs> but I really enjoy playing with him. <laughs> well, well, we can have that discussion later. Uh, well, that actually brings me to my next question. Since you were first students and then became, obviously, professional musicians, maybe one or two of the most important lessons you learned when you were studying music mm. or performing and, and stuff you learned on the job. Um, gosh. A lot, of, a lot of lessons. Um, well, I'll tell you a really profound lesson I learned as a student. Um, you know, I came uh, to, to the University of Miami. I was a student there as a master's student. And, you know, I came there thinking like I knew something. And, like, you know, and I was, you know, I was gracing them with my presence or something like that. Hmm. And one day, uh, one of my teachers, you know, called me to their office. I was like, why are you always so defensive with everything I say to you? You know, I'm your, I'm your teacher. Why don't you try some of the things I'm suggesting? And then, you know, just try them out. And if they work, great. And if they don't, then don't worry about it. When you graduate, you go on. And boy, that changed my whole attitude as a student. And I learned so much from that particular professor. And um, it really, um, I think as a teacher, it informed me how to try to, because we're critiquing students a lot, we're, we're criticizing them, we're saying, okay, well, that didn't work that well, so why don't you try this way, you know, trying to figure out how to, you know, tell that to students without having them be, uh, you know, defensive or uh, upset about it, but just, oh, okay, let me try it, because we're all here to learn, and I tell them, you know, I'm still learning, you know, this is a lifelong learning, we never, I hope, never stop learning and trying to improve, we might, not play the way we used to or whatever, but um, you know we're always trying to improve our craft and edit it and hone it. Great, know. that's that's some really, really great advice. And speaking about learning also, why don't you tell us and our listeners a little bit more about the jazz program at FIU? Yeah, well, uh, you know, the pandemic was hard on everybody, but I'm happy to say that we have a lot of students back on campus now. Um, we have an exploding drum studio. The, the piano studio is, I think, pretty full for the first time. I have an abundance of bass students. If you're a horn player, come study at FIU, because we need you. <laughs> <laughs> We're always looking for good brass and saxophone players for our program. Oh, and the vocal program is doing great. The jazz vocal program, they've just been invited to perform at the, ja the National Jazz Conference. I guess it's international. It's going to be in Orlando this year for the first time, and uh, the group, the Panthonics, which is a small, smaller jazz vocal ensemble, has been invited to perform, and they're actually doing two performances there, so it's really an honor. It's the first time an FIU student group has played at that national conference. Oh, fantastic, and they will be here, actually, in our studio in December. Oh, the wonderful. Of December. Well, you don't want to miss that. They're really, they're really fantastic. And there are also some performances coming up as well. Yes. Um, well, just in a couple weeks, we have uh, oh, we have a uh, our our music festival starts. <laughs> Sorry, we have an alarm going off here. Well, anyway, we have our FIU music festival, and it kicks off with the jazz band concert featuring Delfeo Marsalis. 
uh, the trombone playing Marsalis. And mm. I've heard his big band down in New Orleans, and I was just, oh, we have to get that guy because it's such fun music. So anyway, that's going to be on October 27th. It's a Thursday night, so come down to the Wertheim Performing Arts Center. Um, later on next month, we have our Latin Jazz Ensemble concert on November 21st. That's directed by our pianist here, Mr. Or Professor Michael Eckroth. And then the Jazz Vocal Concert, which will feature both of our vocal ensembles, is November 28th. Fantastic. And one last question. For anyone who uh, would be an in a student or interested in studying at FIU, uh, any advice for them? Yeah. Um, find out who the teacher is of your instrument and go out and hear him on a gig somewhere. You know, go meet them. Just say, hey, I'm interested in auditioning. You know, sometimes we get emails and stuff, but wow, if we saw a student come out to one of our gigs and was like interested in the music and asking, hey, what tunes should I learn for my audition? And like, we're going to keep that in mind, you know? Mm -hmm. And it's, you know, when you see students that go out and like listen to music, they're really hungry. That's, that's the kind of students you want. Students that are, you know, they're not just doing it because they have to. They're doing it because why would you be a musician unless you really wanted to? And you go out and check out music and learn from the people in the community, you know? Absolutely. And uh, we're going to learn a little bit more because we're going to hear another piece. Okay. And what are you going to play for us? Well, we're going to do one of my favorite songs. It's an Argentinian song called Alfonsina y El Mar, which was about a famous poet. I don't really know all the words, but it's, it's a very sad song about how she, she, she walked into the sea and never returned. Mm. So let's see if we can recreate that.
You're listening to a live performance in the WDNA Jazz Gallery of the FIU Jazz Faculty here on the FIU Music Hour on WDNA 88.9 FM. Please stick around. We'll be right back after these messages. This week, Florida International University's Herbert and Nicole Wertheim School of Music and Performing Arts presents on Thursday, October 20th at 3.30 p.m. at the Wertheim Concert Hall, FIU Departmental Recital. The community is invited to an, a free hour-long matinee concert featuring student musicians within the Herbert and Nicole Wertheim School of Music and the Performing Arts. Also on October 20th at 7.30 p.m. in the Wertheim Concert Hall, FIU Opera Workshop, an evening of French opera scenes. The students of the FIU Opera Workshop under the stage direction of Robert B. Dundas present an evening of French opera scenes. Selections from Bizet's Carmen, Massenet's operas Manon and Werther, Thomas Mignon and Offenbach's Les Contes de Hoffmann will be presented. The program will be accompanied by musical director Juvenal Correa Salas, on Friday, October 21st at 7.30 p.m. at the Wertheim Concert Hall, Francesca Khalifa Film and Piano Recital, dedication to Germán Diaz. The, the evening features Italian-Egyptian pianist Francesca Khalifa, winner of the Ferrara International Piano Festival in 2014, for an evening dedicated to Germán Diaz Nieto and others. A short film presentation, Piano Lessons, The Life and Art of Germán Diaz, will be shown before piano recital featuring the music of Herman's brother, Cuban composer Alfredo Diaz Nieto. On Sunday, October 23rd at 4 p.m. at the Recital Hall, Into the Light, an evening of South Indian classical music presented in collaboration with the Tamil and Tamilar Diaspora Studies Initiative at the Stephen J. Green School of International and Public Affairs. Sekil C. Guru Charan is among India's foremost young performing musicians of Carnatic music. Together with V. Sanjeev on violin and Delhi Sairam on Bredingam, they will present known literature from different parts of India to celebrate the Festival of Lights Deepavali. And also on Sunday, 20, October 21st at 7.30 p.m. at the Wertheim Concert Hall, FIU Music Festival 2022, Jazz Party Kickoff with Delfeo Marsalis, Grammy Award-winning trombonist Delfeo Marsalis of the legendary Marsalis family is opening the FIU Music Festival for a New Orleans-style jazz party not to be missed. He will join our very own FIU faculty jazz quintet and FIU jazz big band for a party like no other. Featuring music from his latest album, aptly titled Jazz Party. This album embodies the ebullient and cheerful characteristics of the New Orleans community. 
For these and many more exciting events, you can find information at fiu.universitytickets.com. And now back to our show with FIU jazz faculty, Mike Eckroff, Jamie Ousley, and Ludwig Afonso.
You've been listening to the FIU Jazz Faculty with professors and jazz coordinator Jamie Owsley on bass, Mike Eckroth on piano, and Ludwig Afonso on drums on the FIU Music Hour on WDNA 88.9 FM. I've been your faculty host, Dr. Russ Spiegel, and along with our executive producer, Dr. Karen Veloz, I'd like to thank our crew of FIU graduate students, Samantha, Josephine, V, Gabriel, Jerry, and Christian, WDNA sound and tech wizard, Alex Audrich, and the staff of WDNA 88.9 FM for today's broadcast. If you would like more information on all our programs, make sure to call 305-348-2896, or you can like our Facebook and our Instagram pages to stay up to date with all our upcoming performances. Thank you so much for joining us, and make sure to join the FIU Music Hour for more great music every Tuesday, 11 a.m. to noon. Thank again, thanks again to our guests, and what's the last tune we're going to hear? In honor of Halloween, we'll do a little monk, Monk's Dream. Wonderful. <laughs>